What's up everybody, this is Chris from DACCAST Model Reviews and today I will be reviewing my 118th scale Ferrari 456M by Barago. I picked this up at a kind of an antique store or whatever in Detroit Lakes. I paid $18 for this, it was 25% off, so for this and the Aston Martin V8 Vantage I paid 18 bucks for both of them, so it was a really good deal. Uh, since it's Barago, I don't know what the quality will be like, but hopefully it's good since it's it was a steal, it was one good deal. So, to start off, it's a really cool color green. I actually really like this color. It's a, it's like a forest green kind of. It looks really nice. Uh, it's got the flip up headlights, uh, fog lights, and the grill. Pretty good. Uh, it's got the wheels, five spokes. Uh, it doesn't have the Ferrari logo in the middle, which I'm kind of a little disappointed. But it looks pretty nice, and you've got the little air vents, and then Pinin Farina logo there. On the back, you've got the taillights, Ferrari horse, four exhaust pipes, and license plate, and then Ferrari logo up there. Kind of disappointing this because they didn't actually get as much detail. Uh, so to start under the hood, it's really nice. The headlights don't pop up, but it looks like they can because you got the lights there. And you've got the, it's a really detailed engine for a Brago. And that's what holds the hood down, so when you, it'll look like this if you don't snap it. So the good part is, when you flip it upside down, it doesn't open. Now to the trunk, nothing special. Trunk opens and good sized trunk. Uh, it's in tan. And then finally, the interior, it's pretty good detail got the door panels that are really nice. Uh, could use a little more detail though, especially right there. And stick shift in there. Don't really know if you can see from here, but it's not in gear. It's, they just kind of put it off to the side. Uh, and then the steering wheel looks really nice. Same with the controls in there. It's a sticker, but it's really nice. And over here, you got 456 GT written there. Camera to tell here. There's a bad camera. Seat belts aren't really the best detailed. They're better in the back, but I like the color on the interior. It goes really good with the exterior. And then you've got the mirror and the sun visors. So that was my review for the Ferrari 456 GT by Barago. If you have any questions or comments about the car, uh, post them in the comment section below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. See ya.